Okay, this news line is regarding. Well, this the name of this news line is impeach Barack Obama 2012. Walter B. Jones Jr., a Republican representative, has come up with a revolution resolution act of demanding Obama's impeachment in case of Obama and his administration starts an other full-blown military war-like assault or action without the approval of Congress. This came as a reaction to the statement made by the American Defense Secretary Leon Panetto announcing that in order to carry out the offensive the US military needs permission from the UN and NATO alone. Well, well, well. That's one heavy statement from our from the Defense Secretary Leon Panetto. That's a very mind blowing uh, statement from our Defense Sec Secretary Neon Paletto. Well, I'm going to go on. Representative, Representative Jones' revolution states that prime authority to rule on the attack is the U.S. Congress, but not international bodies, be it NATO or the U.N. Expressing the senses of Congress that use that use of, of offensive force by a president without prior or clear authorization of an act of Congress constitutes an, in, an impeachable high crime and misdemeanor under Article Section 2. I mean, Article 2, Section 4 of the Constitution. Jones Revolution said, My opinion, I feel the President Barack H. Obama should be impeached for not going to Congress so he can let the UN or NATO dictate or tell him that the US military can attack or declare war against any state or country. I have some links to this news line about this subject or topic below this video in the definition box about this news line or you can Google do a Google search on this topic uh, on some side notes I'm gonna also read some side notes here this is not the first time President Obama committed an act of treason in the later part of 2009, Obama was given the highest chair on the UN Security Council. President Obama cannot hold two posts at once. It is considered an high act of treason and illegal for an U for a US president to accept any present office or title or any kind whatever from any king prince or foreign state or power under article 1 section 9 well what i just read here and you could google this at your con congression you could google any of this information regarding uh the impeachment of President Barack Obama use of military 
without Congress approval, high crime. That that's that is a high crime. It's very treasonous. And let me look up the article again. This is illegal. It's under Article 2, Section 4 of the Declaration of Independence in our U.S. Constitution. It's considered a high act of treason and a misdemeanor. And, well, and that's also requires Congress to act saying, we got to impeach you, Barack Obama, for committing acts, treasonous acts against um, Article 2 and Section 4 of the uh, Declaration of Independence and the U.S. Constitution. People should write to their representatives, you, I mean the state and U.S. Rep representatives, about inquiring to impeach Barack Obama and also you could call the hotlines and speak to our representatives our US representatives regarding this situation to impeach Barack Obama Barack Obama and Leon Panetto the defense secretary of the United States told Congress you're no longer the boss. You're no longer my boss. The UN and NATO is my boss. They give me the green light to, uh, to basically commit the military in a warlike, a warlike, uh, A warlike assault or action without approval of the U.S. Congress. Well, people, please get involved. What Barack, Ob what Barack Obama and his administration is against the Declaration of Independence and constitutional law. Our forefathers have wrote, had stated and wrote this in our Constitution and Declaration of Independence. It is high treason and a misdemeanor to listen to another foreign power which is the United Nations to declare any kind of warlike military ex assault against another foreign state or country which is Syria and Iran. Uh, it's up to you, the people, to say, out you go, Barack Obama. Adios and goodbye to Barack Obama. You gotta go. You have to be impeached. You broke Article 2 and Section 4 of the Declaration of Independence and the U.S. Constitution. We're not going to permit you to do this anymore. And also, in my side notes, Barack Obama accepted a uh, the highest seat on the UN Security Council. President Obama cannot hold two posts at once. It is considered a high act of treason and illegal for a US president to accept any present office or title or any kind what whatever from any king prince or foreign state or power under article 1 section 9 he accepted a, a f the highest seat with the UN which was a security advisor in late 2009 during the G20 summit which was being what which was which took place in Pittsburgh PA and then he went to New York to accept the title 
the title Security Council, the highest chair that you could hold on the UN, hold within the UN. That's illegal. That breaks Section 2. Let me see here. Article 1, Section 9 of the Declaration of Independence in the Bill of Rights. Um, it's up to you, the people, to say something, to complain, or write to our state and U.S. representatives to immediately impeach Barack Obama on these crimes. Sit accepting a another post with the UN Security Council, one of the highest posts that you could hold within the UN Council or the United Nations. And also he uh, committed, tre him and his uh, administration committed high treason saying you're not the boss anymore, you don't tell us to go to war at any given time. The UN and NATO is our boss. And that's violating once again Article 2 and Section 4 of the Constitution in the Declaration of Independence. Please write to your state representatives and your U.S. representatives to impeach Barack H. Obama from his current post, which is the President of the United States. Um, well, this is Patriot of the Republic saying, Thank you and goodbye. Patriot of the Republic 1, MAF 1989B, Mike Fulmer saying so long and goodbye for now. Adios, everybody. Don't forget to write to your state representatives and U.S. representatives to impeach President Barack H. Obama. It's a must-do. Black African Americans and white American folks to do your duty. Speak. Use your First Amendment right to to write. Use your First Amendment right, freedom of speech, to write to your U.S. representatives and state representatives to impeach Barack H. O. Obama from his current post, which is the President of the United States. Well, goodbye for now. Bye.